Hey, what are you watching? Game of Thrones, you? Game of Thrones? She hasn't touched me for months. She's in Westeros and I'm sitting here with a heart on. We're in a dead bedroom. What's that? Come with me. The girlfriend and I, our sexless relationship, you know, we're not the only ones. Right now on Reddit, there's a dead bedroom subreddit that has over 25,000 active readers. There are forums all over the internet of people telling their stories of no longer having sex with the people they love the most. I was reading an article in the New York Times and it said that there are four times as many Google searches for people in sexless marriages than there are for people in unhappy marriages. It's a real phenomenon and it's something that we as filmmakers really wanted to explore. It started with a friend of mine. He came to me and he said he and his wife had stopped having sex. But because of the economy, their kids, various anxieties, he couldn't get out of the relationship. Unlike millions of other people, he decided he was going to do something about it. He broke bad. He became the Heisenberg of San Fernando Valley massage parlors, totally isolating his family life from his secret life. His story led him into so many interesting areas regarding lust, love, technology, marriage, family, identity, secrecy, that we knew we had to follow it. That brings us to Dead Bedrooms, the movie. Our story follows his story. Because of the nature of the story, we had to do some things to protect his identity. We had to change the way that we told our story to try to make sure that things were safe for him. We are going to try to make Dead Bedrooms hug the contours of reality as closely as we possibly can. With Dead Bedrooms, whenever possible, we're going to use real people in real locations in real events. It's not purely documentary. It's not purely fictional. It's something in between. My name is Brandon Gilbrick. My partner is Bradley Novikov. We're the producer and director of this movie. And what we need is your help to be able to tell this really interesting story. We're offering a range of perks, all related to dead bedrooms, from infidelity kits to t-shirts to days on the set. We want to tell a story that is as provocative as it is entertaining, about the intersection of technology and romance and how it affects our lives. And really, we think we can help people who are stuck in these situations. Say it. Come on, say it. Ultimately, it's a story of hope. Too long, blonde hair.